Hello students. Today we shall do singular and plural nouns. Singular means single, plural means more than one. Now, in this chapter we shall learn about singular and plural nouns, how to convert singular nouns to plural nouns and to rewrite sentences by changing the nouns from singular to plural or plural to singular. Now read the given poem. Once there was a peddler who sold caps. But he was not like an ordinary peddler. Carrying his wares on his back, he carried them on top of his head. First he had on his own checked cap, then a bunch of grey caps, then a bunch of brown caps, then a bunch of blue caps and on the very top a bunch of red caps. Now all these highlighted words in the poem, we have to observe them. The words peddler, cap and head are singular, that means one. And the word caps and wares are plural, more than one. Now, singular means one. A naming word is singular if it refers to only one person, place, animal or thing. Example, a girl means one girl. A mango means one mango. A dog, one dog. A computer, one computer. Now, plural means more than one or many. A noun is plural if it refers to more than one person, place, animal or thing. More than one girl, girls. More than one mango, mangoes. More than one dog, dogs. More than one computer, computers. Now, nouns are changed into plural in the following ways. There are certain rules which we have to learn. Most of the plural nouns end with an S. Therefore, the easiest way to change singular to plural is to add an S to the word. Bird, birds. Cup, cups. Desk, desks. But there are certain nouns that end with S, certain nouns that end with X, certain nouns that end with CH and certain nouns that end with SH. For these, we have to add ES to form plural. Lens, lenses. Fox, foxes. Bench, benches. Church, churches. Dish, dishes. Brush, brushes. What are we doing to these? All these are words which either end with S, X, CH and SH. For all these, we have to just add ES to form their plurals from singular to plural. Now next, nouns that end with a Y and are preceded by a consonant. This is a noun, fly is a noun which is ending with Y and it is preceded by a consonant. That means Y is preceded by L which is a consonant. That in this case, the second last letter, that means second last letter is L last letter of the word which is a consonant will form plural by changing the y to ies so in such cases where the noun ends with y and it is preceded by a consonant the y changes to ies fly becomes flies puppy becomes puppies city becomes cities because in all of these they are ending with y and they are preceded by a consonant so in these cases the y gets transformed to ies more examples are baby becomes babies, lady becomes ladies, cherry becomes cherries. Third, nouns that end with a Y but is preceded by a vowel. In the previous case, it was preceded by a consonant but over here, it will be preceded by a vowel. Then what happens? The second last letter in the word is a vowel. It will form plurals by adding S. Like in toy, it is ending with Y but it is preceded by preceded pre means coming before so before y comes o which is a vowel so what happens it just becomes takes the plural by adding s toy becomes toys key becomes keys only in case of being preceded by a vowel with words ending only with y so ray rays boy boys day days chimney chimneys now some nouns have the same singular and plural form you have to keep this in mind sheep sheep fish fish dear dear some nouns have irregular plurals that means they do not fo follow any format or rules or regulations child children man men foot feet woman woman mouse mice ox oxen now students i hope this is clear to you now there are some nouns which end in O, they change into plurals by adding S. Like piano becomes pianos, banjo becomes banjos. 
but plurals of some nouns ending in o are formed by adding es like these examples mango mangoes potato potatoes es is being added these are some exceptions now nouns that end with f or fe form the plural by removing f and adding vs all these things you have to memorize where it is ending with f or fe like f it is a calf is ending with f and life is ending with fe what happens when they form the plurals f is removed and it is ves is added to them so these are few examples of such nouns next some nouns ending in f can be formed into plurals by adding s as well roof roofs chef chef chefs dwarf dwarfs cliff cliff cliffs now we will do an exercise from your worksheet 1 now help wormy the worm to write the plural of the following nouns dress dresses chef chefs valley valleys bench benches sheep is a sheep only because it does not follow any rule hero heroes hair uncountable it is it will remain as hair only man men pony because it is ending with y preceded by a consonant and y changes to ies ponies radio becomes radios now write down four nouns that end with s boys cups birds hats with es mangoes calves wolves classes ves calves leaves halves and lives ies babies ladies flies and cherries worksheet 2 circle the correct plural form of the given nouns and cross out the incorrect ones the first one has been done for you fox becomes foxes not fox butterfly becomes butterflies because it is ending with y preceded by a consonant l so uh, y becomes ies photo photos woman women tomato tomatoes story stories now children i will tell you about another story after this beach beaches i have not circled this please circle this beach becomes beaches now s t o r y story is kahani s t o e r e y is kisi building ka manzila so s t o r e y will form the plural s t o r e y s but s t o r y which is kahani or narrative will become s t o r i e s please keep this in mind and please check for the spelling before you write the plural worksheet 3 rewrite the following sentences by changing the underlined nouns to the plural form the book fell off the shelf the books fell off the shelves shelf becomes s h e l v e s next the man sat on the bench the men sat on the benches the tiger chased the wolf the tigers chased the wolves the puppy fell into the ditch the puppies fell into the ditches the cap flew away the caps flew away the lady waited for the bus the ladies waited for the buses the goose looked at the peacock the geese looked at the peacocks the child ate a pastry singular child plural children this is irregular form of plural ate a pastry pastries because it ending with y preceded by a consonant r so y becomes i e s the fairy played with a little child fairies played with the little children the cat killed the mouse the cats killed the mice now we will go over to worksheet number 4 fill in the blanks with the correct form of the words given in the brackets the baker baked some cookies and muffins the child becomes children are climbing up the big trees mother bought a packet of chips and a loaf of bread can you play the piano the cherries why because it is ending with y preceded by a consonant r so y becomes i e s the cherries are sweet but the strawberries are not same as cherry strawberry also ending with y becomes i e s number 6 paste all the photos in the album my foot are hurting after the long walk my feet because i walk on both my feet the three policemen policeman becomes policeman because there are three more than one are chasing the gang of thieves ending with f becomes ves so thief becomes thieves next 
I saw a few lorries and a big truck ending with Y preceded by a consonant R. So Y becomes I E S. I saw a few lorries. Few means more than one and a. A means single. Big truck. So therefore not trucks. Truck. 10. The pretty butterfly flew from flower to flower. The pretty butterfly. Not butterflies. Had it been there had there been no definite article the and the sentence had only started with pretty then it would have been pretty butterflies flew from flower to flower but because there is a definite article the here therefore it is the pretty butterfly flew from flower to flower now we have come to the end of this chapter children if you like my channel please like share and subscribe and keep the notification button on so that you get to know when I post a new video. If you have any doubts, please mention in the comment section. I will definitely help you clear them. Kindly subscribe students. Thank you.